Well, Luke, it's a nice show of faith there early in the year to get it out of the way. Yeah, um, the plan was always to get it get it done earlier in the year so I can just focus on the footy and um, and yeah, as North just come to me uh, not too long ago and we've done it pretty fast. So yeah, very excited to sign the two years. Last year obviously it wasn't as successful for you personally as the first year. How did you sort of assess your second year in the system? Yeah, it was definitely disappointing to find my, find my way out of the side and not play in, um, in all of the finals because, uh, you know, that's all you want to do. You just want to play in the finals and play in a successful team. So, so yeah, looking back on the year, it was probably a year that I almost had to have because it really woke me up um, to all the things that I probably wasn't doing. And, um, and yeah, it's definitely, definitely a driving factor going into this year, um, going into the pre-season, just doing everything right and, um, and yeah, working on the things that um, I needed to work on. Just on that, what were some of the things you did learn out of last year? Oh, I just need to get stronger and um, and yeah, just have a really good strong pre-season and, and get some continuity back in my footy and um, and yeah, just get fit and, and just get my spot back in the side because there's a lot of competition. Um, you know, we got a, we had a pretty healthy list, so so yeah, it was it was good and just attitude-wise as well, just good just to realise that you know, in my first year, I was lucky to play so many, so many games. Um, it was good just to, to show that it doesn't just keep rolling on, you've got to work for it. So, yeah, it was, it was a year I had to have. Do you feel like this is sort of a bit of a, a year to re-establish yourself? Oh, definitely. Um, yeah, definitely want to just cement my spot back in the side and um, just do all the things that, um, yeah, that, that the boys want me to do to, to keep my spot. And, um, and, yeah, it's definitely a year to re-establish myself because I was just on the fringe last year, whereas in my first year, I, I, yeah, I was in most weeks. But, but yeah, it's a... So it's a while away, so yeah, just looking forward to getting my spot back and cementing it. I guess you probably haven't, as a team, played your best footy in the opening two weeks, but it must be nice to, to get off to a winning start, which you haven't been able to do in recent years. Yeah, yeah definitely. Um, I suppose that's one of the improvements we've had this year. Um, in previous years, we probably would have lost on the weekend, um, whereas now when we're not playing our best footy, we still get the four points and, um, and ground out those wins. So yeah, it's exciting that we still have a few levels to get to and, and we're still winning games, so yeah. Wells, he's a pretty handy recruit. Yeah, he pretty much is a new recruit. Um, we haven't seen him for two years, so it's good to have him back out there and um, he's playing some great footy. And um, yeah, it's pretty exciting just because just we know what he can do on the track, and now he's starting to do it on the field. And um, and yeah, it's really exciting to have him back. What do you expect from Melbourne this week? Obviously, first week was good, pretty ordinary on the weekend. What do you sort of response do you expect from them on Sunday? Yeah, no doubt they'll be pretty fired up after their efforts on the weekend. But um, but yeah, that's out of our control. We'll just do what we always do, prepare to play him, and um, yeah, look forward to getting down to Hobart and getting down to the second home, and and yeah, getting amongst the cold conditions. And just on last year, how much? Did, or I'm not sure if you do or not. Do you lean on your dad when some of the, the times were tough, given he's he's been through all this before? Oh, look, not too much. I suppose he tries to stick his head out of my my footy stuff. Um, sort of leaves it to the coaches. So I had a uh, did had a lot to do with Gavin Brown, um, who was awesome for me just throughout the year and and into to this year. Just keep me on my toes, and um, he, he's a pretty handy resource to have. So so yeah, he's really helped me, and um, and yeah, just just really helped me. Just uh, hopefully cement my spot back in the side. Just one last one on Hobart. You spoke about it being a second home. How exciting is it to get down there? It's become a bit of a fortress now, hasn't it? Yeah, yeah, we've had some pretty good good wins down there, and um, and yeah, we're really looking forward to getting down to to the the new stadium. Obviously, it was new last year, but um, it's still still really nice, and hopefully, we can get a really big crowd and and have another good win.